back to Narayana. As you all know that J Mains 2023 notification has been announced and from this day we are barely left with 30 days in hand for the first session. So today we are here to discuss the strategies and the important chapters that we need to do so as to ace J Mains 2023. So you know that the examination is going to be held in two different sessions that is January and April. So now you might be thinking that in the month of January we are burdened with three different stuffs that is our board examination, our board practicals as well as we need to prepare for the JE mix. So students you may think that let's take this attempt casually and we'll be focusing more in the April attempt. Kindly don't do that because the January attempt will be your golden attempt and why am I saying this because it has been found in the recent analysis that the first session has always been easier as compared to the second one. So why waste an easy session? So now let's come and talk regarding the strategies that we need to follow. So what we have to do is that we have to divide and conquer. What are we going to divide? We are going to divide the chapters as strong, moderate and weak. The chapters which you feel that you are very strong at, what you have to do is do revise the notes, do the previous year questions and do the mock test that too chapter wise. Try to achieve 100% accuracy in this area. The chapters which you think that you are quite moderate so what you have to do is again revise the notes do previous year question and mock test but after doing this mock test you have to analyze the area where you are getting stuck and work upon them then let's come to the weak areas the chapters you are not very confident at what you have to do is that revise the notes and do the previous year questions along with that make yourself comfortable with the standard questions so that agar koi easy questions or standard questions is chapter se aa rahe hai to unko aap chhodi na examination mein now this brings me to the next part that is subject revision ki agar hum ek chapter ya ek subject continuously pad rahe hai to hum bhi bore ho jate hai to kis tarike se subjects ko mix and match karke padhna hai what you have to do is that you have to Clap the similar topics together. So, what do you have to do here? You know that thermodynamics is present in both physics as well as chemistry. So, what do you have to do here? That we two days, we are going to devote two days for this thermodynamics. So, one day physics ka thermo kar liya, so next day we will do the thermo of chemistry. So, variety we are and we are doing the same chapters as well. Then, Atomic structure or modern physics may be very common topics. Hai. So we can club them together. Similarly, kinetic theory of gases and states of matter can be club kiya ja sakta hai. Ab baat ye aati hai ki chemistry may kuch aise chapters hote hai jo ki bahut easy hote hai but scoring bhi hote hai. So what we have to do is that for those easy peasy chapters like polymers, uh, biomolecules, surface chemistry etc. We have to club them together and do their revision in one single day. This is quite possible. You have to do their revision in one single day. After that, you will be able to score 20 marks from this easy section. Now, once we are done with the subject revision, we need to devote time at which time we are going to study. So then we come to the topic that is slot revision. Slot revision means that your examination is going to be held for three hours. And these three hours are 9 a.m. to 12 noon and 3 p.m. to 6 p.m. So what you have to do is that to develop a habit of sitting for continuously three hours. Or agar hum log is teen ghante bat ke pad rahe, to kya pad hai? Kya hum log video lectures dekhe? Ya fir question solve kare? See, examination ya to apke is slot mein hoga ya to is slot mein hoga. We don't know at this point of time, right? So what we have to do is that during this slot, that is during these six hours, we have to do these things. That is previous year question lagai, ya fir we have to do the mock test and then we have to do the analysis. Do not try to study any chapter here. Because agar hum log ye sari cheeze kar rahe, to humara dimag actively involved hai question solving mein. And in a passive way what we are doing, is that we are training our brain to remain active during these six hours. Or, is tarikhe se hamari muscle memory build up hogi and this will help us 
during the examination. These were all the details. Now let's come to the number. See students, if you want to score or get a rank below 40,000, so what you have to do is that you need to gain a percentile of 96. For that you need to score at least 100 marks. So bhai, ye 100 marks aayenge kahan se? So these are the areas where you need to focus upon. From mathematics, physics and chemistry, in total you have to target at least 36 questions so that you can be in a good score of 100. From mathematics you can target 14 questions so that kuch questions galat bhi ho jai, we can get at least 48 marks. Similarly from physics we are going to target 10 questions and from chemistry we are going to target 12 questions. So in total it becomes 36. So now let us see the chapters which we need to focus upon. So if you are targeting a score of 100 you need to focus more on 12th. So as you can see in this whole slide that there are only 1, 2, 3 and 4 and 5. We have only 4 chapters that we have taken from class 11. Rest all of them are from 12th. See students. हम अभी महीना है दिसंबर का, we know that पूरे साल हमने ट्वेल्थ की पढ़ाई की है, तो अगर हमारे एग्जामिनेशन जनवरी में है, तो हमें फोकस भी तो ट्वेल्थ के चैप्टर्स पर करना पड़ेगा ना, क्योंकि इलेवेंथ का तो बहुत सारी चीजें हम भूल चुके होंगे, तो what we are going to do is that we will be focusing more on class twelfth and कुछ चैप्टर्स like environmental chemistry, units and measurements, all these highlighted chapters are from eleventh, so ये कुछ चैप्टर्स अगर हम so if you are a student who wants to target a rank below 10k, so what you have to do is that you need to gain a percentile of 99 for which you need to score 160 marks. So bhai, ab ye 160 marks kahan se aenge? We need to increase the number of questions, right? And not only questions, we need to increase the number of correct questions. So from mathematics, we are going to target 18. From physics we are going to target 16 and from chemistry we are going to target 17. So that agar beech mein kuch questions galat bhi ho jai, toh we can easily score 160 marks. Let's see which are the chapters we need to focus upon. So here you can see that now the content from 11th has been increased. Still you can see that 12th ke part zyada hai. So what we have to do is that कुछ 11th के chapters पर भी focus करना पड़ेगा, कुछ उन्हें भी revise करना पड़ेगा, so that हम 160 के score में रहे। तो कौन-कौन से 11th के topic हैं? All those which are in highlighted. तो क्या-क्या है? Matrices and determinant, LCD, limit continuity and differentiability, straight lines, vector, application of derivative. In physics we can do the unit measurement and errors. फिर सेंटर ऑफ मास, थर्मो, काइनेटिक थ्योरी ऑफ गैसेस, केमिस्ट्री में वही हम कवर करेंगे, पीरियोडिक टेबल, केमिकल बॉन्डिंग, प्यूरिफिकेशन ऑफ ऑर्गेनिक कंपाउंड्स एंड देयर कैरेक्टराइजेशन, थर्मोडायनामिक्स एंड एनवायरमेंटल केमिस्ट्री। सो इलेवेंथ के अभी भी कंटेंट कम है, बट अगर इनको हम रिवाइज कर no, along with this, we need to focus upon relaxation. See, you have put a lot of efforts for this examination. So, for this period of time, please be positive. Take adequate amount of rest, that is sleep properly for 7 to 8 hours and try sleeping at night because this will again help you building your muscle memory. And you have to exercise regularly and eat healthy food. Lastly, but the most important thing is that you have to be very confident about yourself and your selection. So this was all about the J Mains 2023 strategy and the important chapters. Team Narayana wishes you all the very best for your upcoming examination. Thank you.